Hey guys, it's Bianca again. Um, I just wanted to do a really quick Sephora haul. Um, I, my computer's not working right now, so hopefully this video comes out okay. I can't really see myself, so I don't know if I'm going to be able to show you guys everything like I'm supposed to or if my lighting's good. But um, hopefully it's not too bad, and um, yeah, so this is what I got from Sephora because they were having um, like 20% additional additional 20% off of all sale items. So what I did was I ordered $50 of items that were on sale and um, then they took 20% off. Well it was more than $50 but I wanted it to at least be $50 so that I can get free shipping. But it was a pretty good deal. Um, I will try to post the prices because since my computer is down, I can't log on to the internet and look up the prices. And if you guys order from Sephora, then you know that you get like this invoice right here. And um, it doesn't really tell you how much you paid for each item. It just gives you the item breakdown. So I did get three things and I got three samples. So I'm going to show you a total of six things today. Um, the first thing that I got is going to be this um, little Tokidoki set of brushes. And this is the Pitura brush set, 24 karat edition. And it's really cute. The packaging is really cute. I love Tokidoki. I'm not a Hello Kitty fan. So, um, and I have liked Tokidoki for a long time. Tokidoki is actually, I believe it's an Italian um, artist or designer that he designed. Um, these characters or came up with these characters and they're more like more like Japanese style um, characters but I do know that the person, the artist or the designer is actually Italian. Um, so then you have this in the back and it is four brushes. I'll show those to you guys. They are very soft. I actually took them out already, so I just put them back in so you guys can see how they come. The packaging is cute. So each brush um, comes with these little things here, and what I like about it is that you can take it off because although it's really cute, I mean, sometimes you're not going to want all this noise going on when you're doing your makeup or whatever. So you can um, take them off or put them on or whatever. So I really like that. This one has like Mr. Um, Latte and then just the Tokidoki um, logo. And then that's what the brush looks like. Hopefully you can see it. And um, so they all come like that. Every one of them has like a different thing. Like this one has... Um, Chow Chow. Well, Chow Chow Star. That's different than Chow Chow. And then this one over here, they all have the Tokidoki logo and then one character. This one has the Adios Star. And this one has, um, I don't actually know the name for this character, but it's like a little unicorn with a little um, star on it. And it's pink and white. And basically the brushes, they're really soft. Um, obviously they have to be synthetic. I don't know if it says that on the packaging, but I'm pretty sure they're synthetic. Although they're very soft, um, I don't know. It, they're, I mean, the quality's not bad, actually. So, I actually got them because they were just super cute, and I thought I could use these on the go. Yeah, I'm not sure. It doesn't really state it here. But, I believe this is a Sephora exclusive. But um, basically, these are the brushes. So it's like a face brush. Um, I think these are okay for traveling. Like for a face brush, um, I think that's too small for me. I like bigger face brushes, but it's not bad. And um, so I'll give you a comparison. This is the um, Sigma large powder brush, and it's an F30. And you see the size difference? This one's way, way smaller. So it's like a little travel set. This is cute. That's what I wanted it for. And, um, yeah, it's pretty darn soft. Really soft. I really like the softness. And um, it also comes with three of these. Now, this is like a flat brush. 
you can see that. And these are more, um, like this one is more dense and um, it's fluffier. And this one also. And this one, this is like a concealer brush. And these ones are for like eyeshadow. And there's two sizes. And you can see what that looks like. And this is what they look like. They're very cute. They're very soft. I do like the quality of them. I would have preferred if they would have done like a crease brush and a, like a blending brush and um, just a shader brush. Those three maybe. But this is what they did. The quality's not bad. And I like what I got since I did get it on sale. Um, I think it was worth it. Um, the next thing that I got that was also on sale and then an additional 20% off all of this stuff was, was the Too Faced Leopard Love um, Complexion Kit, and that's this one right here. And it comes with, well, it has like a little mirror there, but I won't show you that. So it's Too Faced, it has like a little cute mirror there, and then it has the three colors, and I just dipped my fingers in there. So I'll show you guys swatches. I'm going to do bronzer, blush, and brightener. Okay. So that's those three right there. So bronzer, blush, and brightener. They're, they're really, um, they are, like, very soft. They're, I don't know if they're, yeah, they're, the quality's good. I like them. They're kind of like creamy. They're not too powdery. They're not that bad. It does have a lot of shimmer, though. So, if you don't like too much shimmer on your cheeks and stuff like that, you might not like this. But, I like it. It's cute. And, uh, so it's basically, it has peach leopard, candy leopard, and pink leopard. Um... And what I do like about this is that in the back, for um, people who are not experienced with this stuff, it shows you, like, the little face and where you should put it on, and it gives you, like, a, a brief description of what you should do with it. So it shows you right there. So I thought that was really cute. And um, Too Faced, uh, their packaging is really cute, but a lot of times it's very inconvenient. Um, the way they package things makes it really hard to carry with you, like if you're going somewhere or whatever. So I like how this is compact and it's really flat and it closes well and it's just easy to take with you. So with this one, it comes with a little um, primer, skin smoothing face primer. And I originally thought that this was going to be for eyes. I don't know why. I didn't read it. But obviously it's for your face and it's that big, uh, 0.17 ounces. And then it, oops, it comes with a little flat, uh, flat buki brush, so like a little kabuki brush, but it's flat, so you can see that. Um, and actually, this is the same as this. They feel exactly the same this and this. Not like the thickness, but just like the bristles. Whatever it is, it's soft and it feels the same. This one and this one feel the same. So yeah, and they even look the same. If you can see that or not. But um, also, it comes with a lipstick. And I really like how cute that looks. And it's called Cougar. I don't know if this is going to be a good shade for me. Um because, I don't know, it's too chocolatey brown, but I will try it out and see how that goes. I'll show you, like, a little swatch, I guess. I'll put it here. And that's what it looks like. So, I don't know, I think that's too brown for me. But, um, I'll try it out and see how I feel about it. It's so cute. I like that. Okay. So that was the whole little Too Faced Leopard Love Kit. And then the last thing that I got was the Kat Von D um, True Romance Eyeshadow Palette. And it's really cute. So let me show you what it looks like when you open it. It's 
So you open it like this, like a flap, and it's kind of cool. I actually haven't looked at it because I wanted to show you guys on camera what it looks like. And it's like this, and it has like the little Kat Von D thing. I thought that was really cute, and this is paper. It's so cute the way they package this. I really like it. And you can't open it unless you break the seal. I was hoping not to because it was so cute, but I guess you have to. Yep. Oops. I totally messed it up already. Good job. Awesome. That sucks. Okay, so if I can get this to open, I can show it to you guys. So I just take it out of the little wrapper thing. And then um, it tells you the colors in the back. And then it looks like this in the front. This feels kind of like gummy or like um, rubbery. Like when you put like those rubbery covers on your um, phone. That's what that um, feels like in the front. But I like the design. And I will show you the color. Ooh. And the mirror looks actually kind of dirty. So it's weird. So it comes with two little um, brushes. And they're two-sided. So it looks like this. So it's not the regular fluffy ones. I've never had these types before that little. But that's what it has. And um, it has a big mirror. That whole thing is a mirror. But I'll show you the colors there. So um, starting from here, there's first class. Techno, then there's Thrasher. Oh my gosh, I can't even read that. Thrasher, Dagger, Lucifer, Glock, Razor Gray, and Slayer, which is the cream one right here. This is cream. All the other ones are powder, and then there's just one cream one. So these are all powder. And this is cream. So I'll show you um, maybe little swatches of them. So you can see just the color. Wow. Holy Moses. The color payoff is really freaking awesome. So I don't know how I feel about the cream one. Seems a little dry for cream one. But um, I'll show you the colors here. So I guess this is first class. This is techno. This is thrasher. This is dagger. And this is lucifer, the black one. So look at that, how pigmented that is. It's freaking awesome. Rawr. And then on this other hand over here, I have, so after Lucifer, oh my gosh, there's Glock. So this is Glock on my pinky. And then this is Razor Gray, that one right there. And then the cream one, you see it's kind of blotchy. I don't know. That's what it looks like, but I really like the colors. Kind of like, it's okay. I've seen better cream ones, like the quality. I don't know how I feel about the cream one. But the other ones are really nice, so you can see those again. How dark that is. Look at how black that is. And it's completely matte. That's Lucifer. And then this one, I don't know if you can see it or not. Hopefully you can see all the little sparklies in it. It's, it's like so pretty. And look at that. You see those two? Yep. That's what they look like. So I'm really happy about that because I really wanted um like a little blue palette. And that was on sale. So even better. That's freaking awesome. Yep. So now that I have dirty hands and I don't have anything to clean them with, um, I will show you what else they gave me as samples. Um, if I can get this. 
off of me. Okay, sorry guys. Um, one second. I have to at least get this stuff semi off of me because it's going to get all over the place and I don't have stuff close by. Okay, so I got three samples. The samples that I got was the Jennifer Aniston um, perfume sample. Man, that woman is hot. Wish I had her body, but I hear she works out a lot, so I don't know. Anyways, I'm just going to tell you what I got. So I got Someday by Justin Bieber, and they're all about the same. Looks like that. And the other one I got was the Betsy Johnson Tutu. Look how cute that is. And this one actually is a sprayer. It has like a little sprayer. I prefer those kind of samples. And the Jennifer Aniston one is also a sprayer. Just the Justin Bieber one is not. So see, this is the Jennifer Aniston one. She's so pretty. Okay, that's all I got. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. Share some swatches and um, just the opinion on the stuff as always. Hopefully this was helpful to you guys. And um, you'll check out Sephora stuff when they have sales like that. So I was really happy about the 20% off. So you're already getting an item that is on sale and plus 20% off of that. So it's freaking awesome. Um, I'll try to post this soon and hopefully uh, look for the prices and post those too. Thank you. Bye.